I've got a list of them and these are also on our website. So when you have the keywords increased by, more than, combined, together, total, some are added to, you're going to make that into an addition statement. If you have the keywords decreased by, minus, less, difference of or between, less than, fewer than, you're going to use subtraction. Um, if you have in the word problem of, of is very, very common, times multiplied product of, increased by a factor of, you will use multiplication. And if you see these keywords per, a, uh, out of, ratio, quotient, percent, percent is always divided by 100, by the way, you will use division. And then some keywords for um, an equal sign when you were actually writing an algebraic equation would be is, are, was, were, and notice those are all to be verbs, gives, yields, and sold for. And that will be an equal sign. Okay, so let's go back. I have this our... list of keywords here, and I'm going to go ahead and work one example. And the example is, I'll go 8 plus y. Well, I know I have addition, so I can use sum, okay, and I can use added to, so I'm going to do the sum of y added to 8. And if you don't like the term added to, then what you could use, you could use um, y plus 8. That would work also. And sum tells you that it's addition. Okay, let's look at a couple okay. more. Next, let's move down to 9b. And with 9b, I'm going to use the word multiplication. A lot of time product is used. So I'm going to use the product of 9 and b. Okay, if you don't like the word product you could be you could use multiplied nine um, nine multiplied by b okay but I, I actually like product of nine and b the best next we're going to move down to a subtraction problem and for there you can use difference I, I'll go with nine less than x or if you don't like that you could go difference because difference tells you so difference of x and 9 okay again you can just uh, I'm using this sheet and I'm just kind of plugging in words that represent the correct um, math operation and let's go with two more quickly. I think you're kind of getting the point of this one. This was a little tricky because you have multiplication. And so why don't we try the sum, which means tells you that we're going to add sum of 5 and 8 times r. And if you don't like the word times, you could use multiplied multiplied by r, or any of these terms that represent um, multiplication because 8 times r, that's multiplication. And finally, the last one, subtraction. I'm going to use the word difference. Okay. Again, on my chart, I could use difference. I could use uh, fewer than, but it's the difference of 4y and him. Okay, that's how I could write that. Anyway, hope that helps in setting up writing. This is kind of opposite. We're taking the algebraic expression and now we're translating it into words. I hope that helps. I'll leave a link to this uh, chart of keywords. Remember, Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day.